everybody. Okay, so we are starting our prep for Pismo. Finally, we're gonna get some sand, I think. You think so? Think so. Hopefully. Um, we had reservations, they've all been canceled because of what's going on, but we are booked for the first two weekends in October, so that's fast approaching. We have four weeks to prep, and we have this car just naked and ready to be done, right? Yep. I mean, we got Stangers. nothing going on. It's got 60 miles on it. We haven't even broken it in. We haven't broken it in. We need, okay, in order of importance, like we need communications, number one, because I'm going to be driving it some of the time, and you know, I got to be like, breaker, breaker, one, nine. I can't see in front of me. Um, too short, and the seats doesn't go far enough forward. Over. It does, though. Um, we need to get a roof. We need uh, to be legal. We're supposed to have, what do we have to have? We have to have a flag, so we're going to use something that we have laying around the garage, which is an awesome thing. It's a lighted whip with the flag on top. Yeah. Guardian Motorsports. Thank you very much, David. Um, we are going to need uh, mirrors because yeah. we can't see. you got to see what's behind you because everything's always behind us. <laughs> Kidding. But uh, we got to see what's behind us. So when our friends at Kimimoto, who we've dealt with in the past, you guys know that, um, heard that we were in need of some mirrors, they sent us a product because they wanted us to show you guys how awesome it is. So... Uh, so we're going to put some Kimimoto side mirrors on our new 2020 RZR Pro. That's step one. Um, but let me show you the Christmas in our garage, what's happening. All this stuff, oh yeah, that's coming too. So I won't even tell you guys. Yeah. This, I don't know, I'm excited about all of this. So This, this is tonight, the rest of it's for something. Yeah, so tonight we're going to do this too. We're going to be doing some tire installation. Yeah. Um, we're going to put some paddles on the razor, which makes my heart happy because that means there's going to be sand, and I haven't seen them dressed up with paddles on yet, so I'm pretty pretty excited. You excited? I'm excited. All right, so first things first, mirrors and then tires, yeah? Yeah, take a look at what we Let's have. Let's see here. what we got here. So what do we got? Uh, we have the mirror. We have one on here just to show it, what it looks like, and then we're going to mount one. We are going to mount uh, one. The mounting is pretty simple on this car, so there's not a lot to show you. Uh, well, these are supposed to be kind of a uh, universal as long as you have like a 1.6 inch to a 1.875 inch, I think, roll bar size, which is a lot. Yeah, and um, then these... Uh, they're, they're made to fit right in the holes that are already there. They rotate this way. They rotate... They rotate this way, and this... And... Whoops. And... The mirror pivots on this point too. I'm going to tell you what about these that I heard that was ex exciting to me. These are the only ones on the market right now that rotate 360 degrees. So yeah. that's kind of cool. And you can, like you said, adjust them up, down, side, side, depending on your height. So pretty exciting. I'm cranked pretty tight right now so they don't move around. Uh, but you can loosen the bolts a little bit and then it becomes a breakaway. So if you hit something, it folds back in on itself yeah. to not just Well, it, it would right now. I just have it so tight that I have. So there's three different bolts. You have a bolt here that rotates it this way. Mm -hmm. uh, and not three different bolts, but three different pivot points. So it rotates this way. Then this turns in and out, but this also rotates side to side. Anyway, we'll show you in a minute. We'll show you all that. So, so these are what, though? I need to see what they're called. These are the... Well, tell me what those are, buddy. That is what we got them in. Thank you guys at Kimimoto. But speaking of Kimimoto, we're going to go ahead and include a link below. You guys can use the, the code below and get yourself 10% off of the Kimimoto mirrors like we got. Um, so here we go. Um, that is what we're looking at. This car is going to get caged, it's going to get tuned, it's going to get shock tuned, it's going to get uh, long travel suspension. But I don't know how soon we're, that's going to happen because it's a bunch of money and you know we have to do what we can when we can. Well, listen, so, and because and, we, oh sorry, go ahead. I was going to say we have to figure out, still have to figure out how we're going to get this places, yeah, we'll but I can pull it. We're doing it. We're going to talk about that later. We'll show, we'll put a link to that video. <laughs> You can go a little bit faster. This is you know, I'm not going to go a little faster. <laughs> anyway, so in the meantime, what we're doing is uh, whatever okay. its name is. Uh, rip, I think. Rip. Trip and Rip. Rip is getting some hand-me-downs from Trip. Uh, wheels and tires, paddles, because Trip's getting some some other ones, and we'll show you that in another video. Yeah. But to do that, uh, we have some wheel adapters. So here's what we have for tonight. We have wheel adapters. Mm -hmm. We have a lighted whip. Yep. We have mirrors. Yep. And we have a level. That's I'll, right. We'll talk about that. We'll later. talk about that later. I'm excited. Are you excited? Yep. Let's do this. Let's do a Pismo prep. And it says you can see the back tire now, which is a new new to the market on these mirrors. So well, let's check it out. So this car is a long way. 
So I'm gonna loosen this up because I had it cranked up pretty tight. Mm -hmm. Let me loosen this up. Okay. And then we'll play with the, with the adjustment, and then we'll mount the other one from scratch and show you that whole process. Yeah. But so it pivots this way. Mm -hmm. It pivots that uh, rotates. That's moving because it's loose. Let me tighten that a little bit. Okay. And then it rotates uh, this way on that ball. Right okay. Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it goes in and it rotates. Wow. Around. Okay. So lots of rotations. Yep. So I would say, as far as on the wheel tire, rear tire, I would say that's a. Can problem. you see my foot on it? Like I have yeah. my foot I'll on. See our, once we get the paddle on, I'll probably be able to see it. But uh, these tires are kind of tucked into the car. No, definitely. not really. Uh, there's not like a big offset on the yeah, on these. But there will hiding. be. There will be. We will definitely be able to We're gonna get put your foot right next to the to the bottom of the tire. Can you see it now? Well, it depends on. You could definitely set it up for that for sure. You don't see what back tire? There is not one. Yeah. So that's why. We're gonna change that. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna change it with some uh, with these adapters, which are an inch, and then the offset of those wheels and tires. But later, even more with uh, long tail. We got a lot of stuff anyway, going on. Let's do mirrors. Let's do mirrors. Okay, starting here, we are about to install the other mirror. We had that one on, so we could show you guys. And now we're gonna put this one on, show you how easy it is. Yep. So it's just two screws right here. Mm -hmm. This clamping mechanism is pretty cool. Awesome. Okay, so this, like I said, the clamp is adjustable from, I think it said 1.6 inch to a 1.875 inch roll bar. Yeah, the way it works. Look at this. It's pretty cool. I mean, it's, it's pretty stout, man. Pretty beefy. Well, this is supposed to be corrosion and weather resistant. Right. Um, it's uh, CNC'd. We'll find out. We're going to... Uh, well, yeah. Fismo, so. It's supposed to withhold, uh, withstand any harsh conditions, which is awesome, because, you know, side-by-sides oftentimes end up doing some more harsh... Ours does. So, we'll be the one to tell you. Mm-hmm. Okay, so it seems like pretty easy so far. Yeah, so you just run these two screws in pretty evenly. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm gonna bring it down to, I'm gonna go look at this other one to see exactly where we have it. Exactly where, I want it on the nose. Yeah, basically I have it touching that rubber piece so it's as low as possible. Okay. And this is where the level comes in. Ready yeah. for this? We know how you roll. So what we're gonna do, is we're gonna put this level across right here so that we have these rotated exactly the same because when we do, they'll be flat against the level. I see what you're saying there. All right, so this <laughs> Does that one look flat? Yes. Do they both look flat? Yeah. All right, we're going to tighten these down where they're at. You get situated in there, and then what we're going to do is I'm going to adjust this mirror for you, and then you can see that process as Let you Let me would. just say something. Point of view. I'm pretty happy about the pedal position. Yeah. Because uh, look, I can see everything. I can reach it. I think this can you part. See? Can you see back here? Let's see. Um, I can see you right there. No. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I see. I think it's a little far in, right? Uh, yeah. Um, no, that's too far out for me. You get it roughly where you want it. I want it right. Can that's you see? It. Can you see me now? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Can you see me now? Yep. All right. Here we go. So here again, here are the adjustments. It adjusts like I was saying earlier. It's kind of like a ball. It, it rotates on that ball that way, so you can get it level. It rotates in and out fairly easily. It also tilts this way. So I just jacked it up for her, but she's gonna adjust okay, it I'll figure it out. Like it's part of the driving. You have to adjust your mirrors, right? Well, you're gonna get it roughly where you want it, and I'm gonna tighten it up a little bit more so it doesn't flop around okay. while you're bouncing through the dunes. I'm gonna be bouncing so slow. Yeah. Hi guys, please, you see me? <laughs> <sighs> okay, so that's cool, right? Yep. There's step one on the Pismo checklist. Yeah. And now we're moving on to step Mirror. two. Here we go. We need a flag, right? To we be do. illegal, you need a flag. Technically, uh, 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 I think. You do need a flag. Yeah, we got pulled over once. Technically, lines. it's supposed to be. Yeah. Well, um, we weren't out without a flag on purpose. That was when we were in the truck. Yeah. And for so safety reasons, we wouldn't be out like that. But yeah. So here's what we're doing. We're going to kill two sp stones with one bird. Two spiders with one flamethrower okay exactly so we're gonna put a 
safety device flat yes. on the car. Just happens to be a lighted whip because we have it. Which now is we awesome. Can't, we can't actually, we have a little bit of an issue. We'd have to pull out. To, and we're not going to wire this tonight. I'll, I'll wire it up later. Okay. Right now because we got to get to wheels and tires. Right. But this is what's going on. Come around here. I'll show you. We're going to go ahead and mount it up. Mount, okay. Put the and what you say was cool about this whole thing is that there's a little mounting. Yeah. Mount. So Polaris uh, was kind enough to have a couple of mountings points already set up Thank we you. have this spring we like have a thought bolt. of everything yeah and so we're gonna stick the bolt right through here we can't see you okay right. so this thing's getting ready for its maiden voyage it's first ever it's virgin sand it's a virgin to the sand i'm so excited dirt's one thing dirt's fine for you guys the dirt's number one and dirt's I get okay it. when you can't get yeah. sand for me <laughs> for like two trips and then you i'm just over just it off everybody that loves their dirt you know what dirt's good it's we don't good. we don't like going fast anywhere but we just prefer sand we do number one it's more it's our preference we're not saying it's better it is though i'm saying it i'm sorry i'm not cut <sighs> Listen to me. I like it better. I do too. It's America. But we're not saying it, it's better. We're just saying we prefer. Because it's better. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Got to make some people mad. I'm kidding, guys. Don't worry. All right. We're going to crank this down. It's nice and tight. Okay. I see those banners in the background looking pretty good. Dandy Off-Road. I got some Sand Asylum. What's going on, Brian, in April? Missed them. MTS Off-Road. Ned, I hope you're working on a tune for this guy. I really hope you're in prep stages right now because we're going to need that pretty quick here, buddy. Yeah. Hopefully he comes out to Pismo with us. Yeah. MTS might make an appearance on the beach. Who knows? Uh, uh, he has surfer hair. <laughs> right? All right. Here so we, we put the mount in. We have the wiring over there. We'll get it wired up later. That's how it's going to go in. We can't put it in right now. That's pretty good. But that's one step closer to the sand. Woo! Done and done. Okay. All right. So that's done. Uh, What's next? Now the big thing, and the big thing is this garage is a mess. But the big thing is getting sand tires on because this would actually do okay in the sand. I don't know that carnivores are the best. I think bighorns are probably better. Right. I'm not 100 percent on that. Don't quote me. But um. But we're putting paddles on. But because that's gonna be my first time driving in the sand alone, we kind of want to be prepped all the way, right? Well, not only prepped, but it's gonna widen it up. I think we're gonna. Um, I hear from a little birdie that we're gonna because we need this. We're probably gonna do some radio communication type stuff in this car, right? Yep. You want to be able to talk to me? Oh yeah. Because <laughs> yep. you want to say secrets and tell me nice things. Yep. I knew it. Okay, so what are we doing what now? A great job you're doing on driving. I am gonna be doing it because I'm gonna be following your line. All right, let's <laughs> do this. Awesome. <laughs> We'll right. be right back. Okay. Okay, what's going on? I'm about to do some type of tire type of putting on. Yeah, what do you got there? I have a DeWalt um, right here in my hand so that I can go ahead and remove the tires. Wait till you see the one we have coming. I know, I'm excited. We have a three quarter inch deep socket on here so we can pop off the lug nuts on the carnivores that we have on the RZR Pro. And we're gonna swap them out. We're gonna put some spacers on so that we can utilize our existing paddles because we're using adapters. Put, some adapters, yeah. I'm sorry. Some adapters to take this from to take the the wheel pattern, is that what it yeah. is? It's four one fifty. 4156 to 4137. Yeah, so it's going from a can am to a razor. We'll show you. The, there's an adapter right there sitting on top of that tire. We'll bring That's going to happen. We'll bring it up here and show yeah, you what's so going right on. Right now, what I got to do is make sure I got my stuff in the right order and then take these off. Yep. And we do have a new tool coming. I'm pretty excited. Yeah. Does it matter when you're taking them off if you switch around? Nope. Oh, you don't need to put them on? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Okay. You know what? Better safe than sorry, right? Yeah, right. When in doubt, just do it the safer way or the. All right. Let's roll that aside. Okay. I can go get. Now we need to go get the wheel adapter and. Yep. And the, and the paddle. Tire. Yep. yep. Paddle. Ah! Okay. So what are these? These are the Santas, the 30s that we've been running on a trip. Yeah. Can't uh, Tusk sand lights. Tusk sand lights. We got those in Glamis, right? And we have. And we have some more right over there that are 32s. We'll talk about that later. Yeah. That's another video. Uh, stay tuned for that one. Uh, people stay have asked. Uh, people have asked about what's going to happen in that video. Do I need to get a file and do some uh, modifications? So we're going to do that in a minute. We'll talk about that. Right okay. Now. Okay. So, so let's explain to people in case I know that some of you watching right now already know what the deal is, but Look. for the rest of you that don't, we'll explain it real quick. Okay. So here's the original bolt pattern for the razor, which is four one thirty-seven. 
four one fifty six. And sorry. one fifty six is the measurement. Okay, so four one fifty six is the bolt pattern for the twenty twenty RZR Pro. Correct. Well, and for our the current setup that we have on these tires, Can, right? Can Am, the, Can -Am, yeah, the bolt pattern is a five four. I'm sorry, four one. 37. Yeah, four is the number of, of bolts. Okay, so studs. four, four, 137. And so we're out of four, 156. And we need to put on some tires that have a bolt pattern of a four, 137. Some wheels, yeah. So we need to adapt to that. So yeah. we got these adapters, right? Yeah. And then, so you see these fit over, slide right onto your existing. That's the, these measurements are going to be right there. Yeah. See how it says right here, 4156 to 4137? Yep. And as right you can there. see, these are the 4156. That's why they're further out. Yep. And, and these then, are the 137s closer in. Want, so yeah. these nuts will come off. And they and will go on here. here. And but, then these are going to have the lug nuts. Yeah. But there's one little issue before we do that. Oh, yeah. we got to do a little modification. Let's see. Let, me show you, let me show you real quick what the go problem is. Go ahead and pop is. it off. Let me show you what the problem is. Come over here. Okay. See that gap? Yeah. Somebody pointed this out on Facebook. I had actually seen it, but I didn't want to go into a whole conversation. So... I just threw the Can-Am wheel on there and took a picture and called it good. But it, this is not the one, but it had left marks. I could see that it was, oh, this is the one. It had yeah. left marks. I noticed the marks and noticed it wasn't plugged. What's happening is catching the edge right here. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do is we're going to machine this right now. Machine. Right? Yeah. So I'm going to stop this. We're going to come back and we're going to be machining this. So we'll show you our technique for machining. Technique. So what are we doing? So here's the deal. Okay. We're not a machine shop. Our, what? We don't have access to machine shop tonight, so here's our machine shop. This right. is our lathe. And some people are going to be, oh my god, it's not a big deal. we got to take off, I don't know, maybe a 16. If, right. you, if you look at this, watch. See those little marks? Yeah. We're going to take off about that much. And this is probably temporary because we'll probably take this out to uh, maybe Scott's house. Yeah. And let him machine it a little bit. Right. Right now. For now. Yeah, this is right. for now. This We're is in just, go mode. This is just so we can get, the, get them on. And get some good pictures and video of how they look. Yeah, I'm excited about it. I haven't seen, I mean, we haven't seen this car all dressed up for the stand yet. He doesn't even know how good he's about to feel about himself. All right. Yeah. All right, well, let me do this and we'll come back. Okay. Hello, Mr. Machinist. Hi, well, what'd you do? Well, we took our lathe here. Right. Fancy. And we just took, I mean, I don't know, what, a 32nd off just just the edge of that. That's all that needed to Got be done. Got rid of the part that was banging yeah, on. Just, just barely. That's all it needs. I'm not necessarily recommending no you more do that. You, yeah, but it fits perfectly. Okay. By the way, if you need a set of these, if you need two of them, <laughs> we actually ordered. It's a long story. We first, have we have a pair. Yeah. yeah. First, I ordered uh, not enough, and then I ordered too many. Anyway, whatever. Uh, all so right. If you need so, some, hit us up. you ready to get back to your job? I am ready. All right, give me that. Okay. All right, so now what I... Can you get my lathe out of the way? I'm sorry, I didn't even see it. It was so, so small. It's a small lathe. It's a small lathe. We have the adapter on, and you're getting ready to tighten, tighten them up. Yep. So we, at some point, we need to look up some tor torque specs, but we'll, we'll run this down right now with the DeWalt. Yeah. Get them in place. And just to get the wheel on, show you guys a Yeah, so right. kind of just lightly run those in. Uh, no, go ahead and run it all the way until it kind of goes... Okay. Uh, yeah, that... Go, no, 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 go across. No, I know, but this one's not even a little bit. The other ones are. Okay, here we go. It's nice that they made those holes big enough for a thick wall socket, but you're a little bit tight. Now I'm going to go one more time around or what? Yeah, go ahead and go around. Just until it stops moving? Yeah, and then we're going to we're gonna torque it down with, with the torque wrench. So we looked up the torque specs and it says 120. 120. That seems, and that's a lot. So what we're going to do is we're going to set the, we're going to set the torque wrench for 120. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to DeWalt one more time, run it down. That DeWalt, I don't think it will get 120. I think the DeWalt got him to 120 already, huh? Oh my god. Wrong, oh, I gotta break this loose. So what do you think? DeWalt already did his job, huh? Yeah. Can I pop the DeWalt on here to get it off? Here. I'm gonna do this last, not last one. I'm gonna continue torquing. Alright, let's do this. <laughs> oh my god. It's hard to push 120 when you only weigh 120. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I guess. All I have to do is like put my leg on it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, the DeWalt. DeWalt, DeWalt took us 
the 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 wall took us to 120. Ready, guys? Holy crazy! Yeah. This is a big moment. I realize they're just some. They're not. They're they're oh they're not bad. The rims are dirty. The tires and rims are dirty. We didn't clean up or anything. We just got in a hurry. It's late in the evening on a work day. We're yeah. both tired, but we wanted to come out here and do this anyway. So here we go. Let's throw that wheel and tire on and let's see what it looks like. Okay. I'm ready. Alright, here we go, guys. <laughs> Moment of truth. Moment of truth. Um, does this need to come off? Nope. Okay. You don't. All you need to do is put the wheel on. Oh my goodness. Yeah, there we go. A Can-Am wheel, wheel on a razor. These are our kids, so they can share stuff. Yeah, it's a little bit hammy. Oh, we got some, we got some width now. Yeah, now you can see. I bet you if I look in the mirror, I can see over yeah. the tire. Well, let's throw the lug nuts on. Let's get the front one on this side and let's get a look at how Okay, now we'll see overall. what it looks like in there, huh? Now we're getting excited. We're getting excited. Because this means sand. This Guys, means sand. When we put paddles on, it means we're not going to be driving on the asphalt. Yeah. Okay, so with this setup, you have two sets of lug nuts. Mm -hmm. We uh, used the lug nuts to, that came with the adapter to put the adapter on. Now we're putting the original uh, Alaris lug nuts on the Can-Am wheels. Uh-oh, yeah. wow. So, I hope, yeah, spin that, spin that around where it's in, okay. There we go. There you go. So run those all down snug, and then we'll, then we'll give them the, the all 120. Yeah, give me the all 120. Yeah. Okay. So let's see if I get this in the right spot. You want to just lay it in there. Oh, I mean, you want to bring it up to where you want, right? All right. Support yourself and then push. Work. I'm going to cross over. Actually, do this the right way. Gently in. Bring it up. Hold it. Nice. Okay. Now we're going to get up here. Got the wall. Okay, so we're in. Oh, that one. Okay. That one has a, a little more looser. Yeah, I yeah. didn't get that one. Do it what? again. Ah! Why don't you do? <laughs> You're making me uncomfortable. Can I just do muscles? All right, all right, so we're gonna do the front one, and then we're gonna sit on the ground, clean them up, and see what this thing looks. Like. Make feet. Bam! This one off. Yeah. We're getting ready for the sand. I'm so ready. I've been ready for the sand. I'm like, yeah. Is the sand ready for me? All right. So we're deciding which one to run on which side. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. I think we want a little more of the bigness in the front. Uh, we got to get the wheel adapter ready. Oh, shoot, yeah. We Let's need put those lug nuts not right in the way. Let's put them like up under the car right okay. now. Okay. And, and we need to grab a wheel adapter. Which is in the car. We won't make you go through this again. We already did it. We'll come back after we have the wheel adapter ready, right? Yep, we'll be back. Well, look at this. Beautiful, beautiful uh, setup we got going on here. Yeah. So, we'll, yeah, we're, we're getting ready to set it on the ground. I want to see who's part. And then we're gonna wipe these down and throw some, uh, I don't know what these marks, these were, are, these were in the, what is this? It looks like tape from when the, when it was all taped up and then dirt got stuck on where the tape was when they there, were new. There was no tape. These are, we've had these for a long time. They have a bunch of miles on them. That's probably paint. Like sticky paint residue. I don't know. Anyway. I don't know, but it's a stripe of, it's a badge So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna drop this, we're gonna get the jack stands out. We're mm -hmm. gonna drop this thing down. We're gonna put some lemon, uh, 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 no, 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 no. I lifted up first. No. Don't touch that jack stand. The car's setting on that jack stand. Oh, raise this up. Yeah. Whoops. Okay. All right. Now. Yeah. Slide this out. Yeah. And watch the fingers. Don't get your fingers smashed in. So we removed the jack stands. We're gonna drop this thing down and take a look and see what it looks like. Uh, we're gonna clean these tires off. We're gonna throw some lemon pledge. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Let me wipe it down right now. Let me do a wipe right now. All right. 
let's do a quick comparison. We haven't put uh, we haven't put paddles on the other side yet. That's too many chairs. We have too much stuff going on in this car. But so let's do this. Here's the side without paddles. Here's the side with paddles. You right. definitely see a difference in the uh, stance in the width. Okay, what I'm gonna do is do a quick wipe with some. Uh... Look at that. Okay, so... All right, we'll be right back. We're gonna clean this thing up. So what we did is we put on our uh, our our Tusk Sand lights. Yeah. That we had on the Can Am, which yeah. meant you know the bolt pattern being different from yeah. the RZR. We have to do some adapter type things. Yeah, that's these. I think you can see them in here. Yeah, you can see them in there. They're all torque to spec. Yeah, they are. Um, shined up a little bit. Yeah. Um, so what we did was we're day one prepping for Pismo. We got some mirrors going on. Thank you to our friends over at Kevin Moto. We got those yeah. side by side adjustable mirrors. Those are three. Oh, you know what you got to do? Uh, oh, the beginning. Shit, I got to yeah. see if I can see the tires. Here, let me see that food. Oh yeah. Carrying it around with me. Okay, let's see. All right. So what we're gonna do now is at the beginning of the video, we uh, we're adjusting this mirror. And we had their stock tires on. Can you see these tires now? Let's see. Oh, I can. Yeah? Yeah. Can you, you see where you How far? Um, let's see. I can see your whole foot. You can? And part of the tire. Okay, that mirror's pretty cool. Awesome. All yeah. Right. So I can see the, every part of the tire that's sticking out past the, I can see, I feel like. Yeah. So let's get another shot. Uh, I don't even know that this car settled well, all the way. I can show it in the mirror, probably. Well, hang on. I'm going to get a shot right here. Okay. I'm gonna go over to the other side. You can see the difference in width. Do me a favor, would you straighten that front tire out? A little more. Ah, right, you're good. All right, so there's that side, the passenger side. Here's the driver's side. We'll put the paddles, the ones on the driver's side or the passenger side on later. It looks uh, pretty good. Guys, we got so many things coming up. We have a lot of things yet to come. We got a lot to do on this Razor. We have Obviously, we need some more accessories and components. We definitely need some communications. I wonder what that's going to be coming soon. Thank you guys for watching and joining us. We really do appreciate it. We love what we do. We love having you along with us. Um, if you haven't subscribed, you're here watching, so please do. It does help us. We really appreciate it. Leave us a comment. We still respond to all comments. It takes a little time, but we do. Um, give us a thumbs up if you like what we're doing. It makes us smile, and it does help. If you don't like what we're doing, we definitely need to know. So just hit the dislike button in multiples of two, because that's how... Ugh. and then we'll stop doing it um we're gonna put links below to a bunch of different things like to our facebook group so we can talk to you we'll be riding in pismo first two weekends in october which is what we're getting ready for um and uh we're gonna put a patreon link that'd be awesome if you joined us along with our friends um thanks guys uh and other than that um thank you right all right we can't do this without you we appreciate you and i uh, look forward to seeing all of you in the sand so thanks again Peace. fastest fastest oh also there's going to be a link below to a facebook group my hubby is now one of the moderators it's an awesome group it's the fastest x3 yxz rzr I'm, i can never remember the name but there's yeah, going to be a link below draggy. there's a link below we'll put it on the screen like we always say and, and we're um, going to put a link below to our playlist. Some of our gonna... times are on there from the can -M. Yeah, they are. But this is an RZR video, Razor video. This is a this Razor. Is a razor. Sir, I don't know where you're riding, but this is a Razor in California. This, look at that. I like the way that's kind of like a shark. It kind of looks like a shark in the front. It is a shark. And all blacked out. It's just so awesome. Okay. When I saw Jaws. this car, I'm like, well, we got to buy it. You okay. did send me a picture that said that. Okay, get right. off on a tangent. But thank you guys again. Um, appreciate all of you. Can't wait to meet you and hang out with you in the sand and camp. Can't wait to feel the sand in my hair. It's happening soon. Thank you guys. Peace. Out. Peace. Hey. Bye, Danny. Because as Danny would say, peace. Uh, we miss you. Yeah. Definitely.